Hello and welcome back to Software Inc. In today's episode, we are looking at some expansion in here. And let's unpause the game and let's see what happens. But we now have our new 2D editor or pencil 2D and we are marketing that quite a lot. And we still have some pretty good units in uh, stock and we let me just take a look at this active users December yeah we don't have actually anywhere to um, port this at the moment it's just like an old operating system which we don't care about so while this runs uh, I've noticed that we have quite a lot of um, bugs queued into the support for that. So what I think I'll do, I'll start with hiring a new support person and invite them to the team. So hopefully that will help. We do have one empty desk over there and I think this will help us out. So this one can do support, can do some programming and art. So uh, Whitney Paris, you are hard. Yeah, supporting. Yeah, I almost forgot to look at that. <laughs> so, oops, we need an extra desk in there. Let me just grab this. I don't need that person. Duplicate this one and get this in there. So now, uh, tomorrow, when they arrive, they will have a place to work on. That's pretty good. And the next thing that we are looking at doing, I was looking here, let me close this. Oh, I just opened it. <laughs> I was looking at or doing an operating system, which I'm quite inclined, or doing an audio tool. So we have like, to the audio tool and then layer a 3d2 as well but looking at the operating system uh, this requires quite a lot of people but if we go like try to increase the expected interest because i don't want to just release this just for the sake of releasing i want to sell some units as well we are now getting some business recognition and for 2D editor antivirus, that's growing, that's increasing, and that's what we want. We are on iteration two of our um, file spy. So let's keep that going. Now, for the operating system, uh, what I would like that let's go with a, the bare minimum to get some interest from, from people. And I think the way to get there is getting more two stars than one stars for example if we add these it just adds like five um to what eight percent and if we add like windowing uh system these grows quite uh quite a lot more so if we try to get like i think we should go for user accounts or maybe multitasking first. Yeah, that goes much better and surrounds out. Hmm. If we already have like two years of development and eight programmers and four designers, that's quite a lot. We could go a little bit further and get, um, I don't know, custom teams go up to 90%. It doesn't matter what we add here. This is the most we can get. If we go with this, can we increase the expected interest in there? Seems like 89 is as much as we can. So let's let's try it. Let's go with that. Let's see where it takes us. I want a new framework. Oh, that increased quite a lot there. Maybe we don't use a framework at the moment. And the problem in using existing frameworks, uh, there are none. So, okay, never mind. If we go with a new one, 
This will help our next version, but we might struggle at the beginning. But let's try it. Let's name our framework as POS, Horde Operating System. And our operating system will be called, uh, how can we call it? Why not? It's the name of the company. Horde OS. There you go. I quite like it. And operating system, computer, and the price for that, let's go with 16999. I think that'll be great, great price for that. And then going to the next page, we don't have independencies. I thought before that we had to, we need to have a 2D interface, but it doesn't seem like it. So you know what? That's fine. And well, for this, it's already uh, as good as possible. Our consumer reach could be up to 138 million people. So that is good money in there. That is good money. And then what we need is basically this, a lot of people in the team. So I think we should start creating our operating system. So let's manage our teams and let's create the Horde OS. Let's add to the list. Let's change the color. We have green, we have white. How about I like that purple. Why not? Let's go with that. So for this team, I do want a team lead because I don't want to keep taking care of everything. So I guess what we could do, I'll hire the first um, employees or will I? Yeah, I think I will because I want some very specific skills over there. And for that, I think we can I'll pause the game now before we go to the next day. But let's hire the first employee. So lead HR high and let's spend money to find the right person. So this will go for the Horde OS and he'll be the first person there. So no compatibility issues. Let's go for skill and look for, well, multitasking is definitely great. We are not doing automation at the moment, so I won't actually care too much about that. Um, but actually multitasking will improve more support and marketing tasks and also development hmm, of any task. All right, that might be good. Handle education, hiring and complaint and salaries. That's definitely what I wanted. But I also wanted team compatibility, socialize and hold meetings. I might go with these uh, introvert and stubborn. Stubborn and introvert. But I think that's the best candidate that we have. And this person can do design and art as well, which is like definitely a big plus for us. So Rusty Green. You are hired, and hopefully you are not as rusty as it seems. Haha. <laughs> so manage roles. Um, I don't remember if I have to click in here. Yeah, lead. All right. So you are the lead of the team. Now, what I want, we might need Definitely we need like more rooms for this. I'll take a look at that very soon. If we go for two rooms, we can hire nine people. So that we need three rooms so we can hire more people. Let's start hiring, um, hiring please. Now we need good designers and good programmers. Let's start looking to programmers and see if we can backfill the, um, the skills for, for that role. Uh, what do we actually need? Ah, there we go. We need system, 2D and audio. So let's start with system. This is the biggest piece of work there. 
and then 2D and audio will be, let's call it, or plus. Um, we have you. So system and audio. We need audio. That's perfect. No design skill, but I think that's definitely a hire for, for us. So let's take a look at um, what is that? HR management. Let's give them probably a bigger budget. Let's go for a hundred thousand. There we go. Um, or team lead can handle wages, complaints. I don't want to change role selection. I'll just leave it. Education, no, let's go up to three. Why this is disabled? I have no idea. We should be able to handle education, belief. Education amounts is the number of employees that can go at the same time. I think I'll set that to three. And then hiring. I think we can keep this as nine programmers five designers and that's it. So we have 14 here plus the team lead, we have 15. Specialization is, hmm, we might, we don't need hardware, definitely. We don't need network at the moment and we don't need 3D and we don't need service or in leads. I think that's all we need there. Development and service. For some reason, we can set the designing, but yeah, that's all good. And salary uh, will go for high because we need people with more skills. So that's what we are doing there. And then, good. So we have our team here. Now we need a room for them. And well, let's probably minimize this or you know what let's finalize this actually um let's change the team to or horde team and by the way this flickering is because i'm scaling the screen so it looks a little bit bigger for you and this happens when i do that so yeah nothing much i can do unless make everything very small and you can see <laughs> so Design and development, that they are. We have no publish publisher and let's develop this. So it's saying two years, let's see how that goes. Probably it's gonna take a little bit longer, but we will see. Next thing we need to do is um, set some new rooms. I won't set up a new room here on the same floor. I'll go up one floor and Least this one, this one, and this one. So three rooms in there. Go down a level and I'll probably select everything that we have in here. Uh, select building floor, entire building, furniture. And then we go there and duplicate. Uh, let me just take a look at one thing. Can we get a new computer there? Yes, we can. So I think we should do that first. Um, so select, what is that? Select furniture types, and then we replace with a new computer. We have this one in 2000, which is two years away, but let's give them a little bit more power because this one, like it's, ridiculous and this improves the environment as well so 90s computer for everyone hopefully in here i've already done that i did so now we can select the whole furniture duplicate go up a floor and put it there and go back down and hopefully oh you know what i think we need one of those in there i forgot about it 
could even add one of those duplicates. Let's change things around. Anything else that we're missing here? Well, as a matter of fact, we are. So duplicate and let's get that in there. And I think we are now good. We have everything. Yeah, I think so. All there. Oh, good. All working. Perfect. Now we can assign this room in here to select employees in room. No, not what I want. Let's select the room to a group. No. Come on. Where's that? Switch team. There we go. Hard. And I think I can select both rooms in there and switch team and do everything at the same time. Cool. So everyone has their own team and room label. There we go. Now we can see where they're going. I don't think we need to turn that on at the moment, but yeah, we can see that we have the antivirus support. Antivirus is actually doing 2D as well. But there we go. They have somewhere where to work and we will hope for the best. Let's see how this goes. Going to the next day, they arrive and they are working on the first iteration. Yay! Smashing bugs as well. We have the antivirus helping in there. We have one more. Oh no, bug burglars. No. Restore for insure. Yeah, thank you. Um, yeah, so Horde OS is on the first iteration. Fire Spy 5 is on the third iteration. It's going quite fast, actually. This is going fast. As you can see, system is more complex, so it takes more time for the Horde OS. Uh, our marketing campaign here is going well. Marketing for Fire Spy isn't doing us any favor, I believe. We sold Pestmouth. $36,000, which is okay, I guess, but yeah, we didn't make any money in that. So I think we will end marketing for this. We don't really need, let's focus on uh, Pencil 2D, which we actually, again, didn't make any money. Can we port this somewhere else? Yes, we can. That might be the reason why we are not making any money there. So File Spy, you will be on new operating systems. And Pencil 2D, you will be on the same one. <laughs> that won't change. So that's good. Uh, problem now is money. Uh, that's quite scary, to be honest. We need to release something else and start making some more money, uh, otherwise, oh, we are on the last iteration for Fire Spy now. But we do need to make some money, otherwise, this would just go down and down and down. We are making a lot of money from interest, which is quite good, which might make me think that we probably want a little bit more money in there. Like, it's always good to have that money coming and uh, helping us paying the bill. So as you can see, 32,000 is quite a lot there. And this month we are gonna make 34,000. Yeah, so this helps. It's like not the best thing, but it helps. I'm keeping marketing Pencil 2D, especially because of the porting job that we are doing. So yeah, we just finished one. Let's see how that goes. I also think we'll have more um, killed support in there. And if that's the case, we should take a look at how many units we have in stock. 
which is getting low now, 48,000. And Horde is on iteration 3, it's actually going really fast. I'm impressed by our team's skill on actually <laughs> handling all that. So we are in August, four employees went on vacation. All right. And well, we didn't sell as much as I thought in there. But if we take a look at this, active users, we do have quite a, a lot of people using it. So that's good, I guess. Um, problem now is that support tasks are going up, especially because uh, the antivirus team is also working on porting and like they have to um, split their work between those tasks. But yeah, when they finish that, this starts going much faster, as you can see. And they almost finished uh, iteration four of File Spy as well. Like this team is amazing. <laughs> They're doing a fantastic job. Like I can give them that. Uh, they just need to work on OS support for File Spy 5 which is great and um, that's good like now on two new operating systems uh, files by four hopefully this sells a little bit and oh we can develop files by five yes there we go let's completely do that i think that this will help us uh, we don't have any more cute support for any of the uh, softwares that we we support at the moment so that's good final iteration for horde os which is great um yeah i think we we're doing well and uh, it's just a matter of actually looking at what's happening and try to figure out what we can do i on the other hand can get some education and i could do support I could do marketing, I could do low. Maybe I should do support as well. So what is that? Wage negotiations. Um, they are not on the uh, hard team that's managed by the team lead, which is also asking for a race, but they can approve their own race. So, Let's accept all and close. Let's teach myself some more support. And let's see what happens next. Like we definitely need some money. <laughs> uh, give me money, please. We almost finished uh, porting File Spy to the four operating systems. We sold more copies now. And there we go. Finish all the jobs there. And I just wonder why Oh, this is an assign. Why File Spy is an assign? Come on. Like I was looking at that and I was like, it's not going anywhere. What's, what's happening? And well, that explains why it's not assigned to anyone. So I guess, yeah, there we go. Much better. Like I'm complaining about money and then I don't assign the project to anyone. Everyone is just sitting without doing any work so yeah i don't think that helps us and we need to call some stuff here let's call everyone and hopefully that will do us some good we have many robins on the support team that can get some education let's get you assistant that'll be pretty useful for everyone and let's go to our next day we made money I think with the porting, I think that's why. Let me see if I still have uh, units in stock. Yeah, I do have. Maybe I'll order like 10,000 just in case. I know that we're probably gonna um, publish this soon, but I want to be really sure that we have those uh, units in stock. It's been a while since you released a night virus and your fans are not seen. I know it, like I'm really trying to get it done, but I have to remind myself that I need to assign people to this team. 
we could give it a boost and get whole team working on there as well and for like one day and see how that goes let's do it let's see what we can what we can make happen in there and the goal is moving is slightly faster and i think we we are good i'll just give it like for for the day and then probably when we get very close to the end here i will start marketing that and getting things like um getting a build out uh, and setting a date for for the release i just don't want to do it too soon and then miss the boat over there and let's go into development of our horde os that's fantastic actually i might leave them working there just Ooh, we need more copies there i forgot about that Twenty-five thousand. <laughs> i'm just talking and then like i just forget about what's happening we're making quite a lot of money i think porting uh pencil 2d to other operating systems did us a pretty good job like this helped us quite a lot great i'm happy with that so finishing this let's remove hordos from from that we don't need them in there uh just keep an eye on this number here and oh there we go 100 percent and their finishing system and there's some support that needs to be done uh, os support rather and i'm happy with that can we get a review on this? Let's see. We haven't finished it completely, but let's see how that goes. And this should be pretty good, I would say. 10 out of 10. Oh, that's actually great. We don't need to iterate on that. Just finish OS support and then I guess we can call it a day. And there we go. And we should be done now. So, okay, let's remove HordeOS from that. Let's promote this into beta. Let's market this. Mm, let's take a look at our calendar. Hold up. When do we have new operating systems being released? We have a new antivirus here, so this is Oh, actually, not operating system, it's an antivirus that we have to look at. Oh, <laughs> oh no. Um, so, our main competitor is launching in September. And then we have an audio tool in November. We should start working on that again. And then we don't have an antivirus until December next year. So, I'm wondering should we go for a december release three months after um anti-warm and we might go for the end of the year sales i think i'll do that so let's mark it december 99 and hopefully this will be time enough for us three months to do it let's do Well, one who is working on this antivirus and support. All right, let's keep it. And let's also do a press build. There we go. So let's see how we, we go now. Keep an eye on these just to see that we still have an units in stock after the day. Yeah, we need more, I would say. Let's get 10,000 more. This is keeping our bills like our company in the green. Um, so the software times pre-release review of files by, oh, I forgot to say priority on this, please. Hold is ready to show off files by five, giving it a test run. Um, it'll be out in a moment. All right. So hopefully people will start to follow this. 239 people following, which is fan fantastic and then i want to just add some more money into 
or uh, invested bonds. So we are a little bit safer with money. Let's keep that happening. We just need to do like this on a really high priority because, well, we need this press release out in one or two months. So yeah, I'm scared about that. <laughs> we really need that done. Can we please? It, it's happening. I, I think we might re like release that a little bit earlier and without that being, uh, to be honest, with that said, what I'll do, uh, well, I'll call someone to clean all this mess and fix everything and I'll probably lease this room as well. And then, actually, let's go. Uh, yeah, I have to pick this one. Let's grab all the furniture in here, copy, and get this over there. <laughs> there we go. And this will be also support in marketing, I guess. And what is the team? Switch team, there we go. Support. And then we hire more marketing people. I think that's the, the way to go there. And then we try to get as much done in November as possible. So service, we need marketing and we need good people. So compatibility with supporting, please. We have a really, can we get three stars there, please? Please look again. Oh, that's quite bad. Actually, we don't have anyone that can do it. Hmm. That doesn't help me. So let's look again. Compatibility, very bad. Oh. Maybe we hire you for one day and fire you again, because like this won't work for the team. But I do need those three stars in there. There we go. So hire you, hire you. Hire you. I don't know how many people I hired now, so let's go with that. I think that'll be more than enough. And let's see. So you need some education and you can learn antivirus. Well, you might learn probably audio. I don't think anyone has audio in the team for antivirus let's do it oh we're not meeting demand again um your release close this and order copies let me order like fifty thousand. so i don't need to keep like a keen eye on this i'll just keep it in there and see how that goes i would say uh let's take a look at this uh we yeah, I strongly dislikes. I know this would happen. I think this is fine. Uh, it's just for today. So we can get as much done on this as possible. And then we can release that at the end of the day. And now we look at our thing and actually go into support. Look at our employees employees yeah and see years in the company so as you can see you four are the ones that we hired and compatibility is really bad so what we're gonna do is actually fire all of you and then yeah i think we we are fine now 
I will probably though look for more people for the team and because we will need more uh, support so I can remove the antivirus team from that. And what else do we need? We need more marketing probably. Yeah, let's take a look. So support, hi, yeah, let's do it. Begin looking, support, and look at compatibility. I think this will mean a little bit more for us at this point in time. So I will hire one, two, and three. And then I will look again for some marketing specialists. Let's go with you. Probably not gonna find like a three stars in that. Yeah, as expected, but we can hire two people in there. You certainly have skills and you as well. So yeah, you can help in other areas. But there we go. I think we have a run in there. We are now in December. Did I remember to release? Yeah, I did release that. All right, and now we are in December and we are ready to actually release our um, software file spy. I might do another press build, why not? And let's wait after lunch and then we will do our release. A lot of bugs fixed. Uh, this is something I like to see. Let's release that. Yes. Do you want to start a marketing campaign? Definitely. Um, so let me pause the game right now. Budget for that. So this will be our new antivirus. Let's give them $50,000. Let's see how that goes. That goes for the support team. We might need to split support and marketing at some point. And let's order some copies. I think I'll start with 50,000 and we can see how that goes. With marketing for our antivirus, new antivirus software there. Do we still need, yeah, we still have 284 active users there for file spy. But the first thing we need to do here is port this into a new operating system which we have quite a few, including this one that just released. So I guess we could go for the three of them, 98, 99, 99. So let's do this. Prioritize that porting job so we sell a lot more when we get there. Now support for files by should go up there. And we keep an eye on how many active users and how much money we make on this on the next day. And we sold 3000 unities and almost 3000 users. So not as good as I expected, but let's see, uh, quality outstanding. So everything is outstanding and this is outstanding. <laughs> Uh, we are almost done with the code for Horde OS as well. And oh, that's quite exciting. So we'll have a new release coming very, very soon for Horde OS. Now that we have a lot of people in here, I might just remove the antivirus team from that one and, and remove from this one as well they can focus on porting that, uh, that antivirus. And then I think what we will do in the next episode is starting a sequence for our 2D editor and release our um, operating system in here. So let's stop here. I think this, this will be good for us. We can go just one more day and see how we did with our sales. So we now have 8,000 active users. Porting is doing its job. I think this will increase. We might have undercut the, let's take a look at all release. No, not this one. 
uh, what is all release, all companies, all software, good. So looking at release time, we have or uh, we are here at the top, last one released, and we have Antwerp Watch released in September. So they did quite well there. I think we might need to increase the budget for marketing. I will up that for a hundred thousand in there. That might help us go up to unavoidable and get more sales. We haven't made a profit, but I bet that on the next month here, we will make a pretty good profit. So I hope you enjoyed this episode of Software Inc. And or new operating system that uh, it's pretty exciting, but today was all about like getting more uh, copies of Pencil 2D, which we still have some in there in stock and um, releasing or fifth version of our antivirus or file spy and then starting to work on the operating system this is all going pretty well and i am quite happy with what we have so far so i hope you enjoyed the episode please leave a like if you did um, ask questions in the comment section or join my discord server the link is in the description and also don't forget to subscribe so you can see what comes next in Software Inc. Thanks, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.